Here's a sensitivity test of our um, audio responsive, now audio responsive, uh, NeoPixel driver that's done without coding, without microcontroller. Um, and basically the setup is a, one of these little condenser microphones. Uh, the output signal is hooked up to this LM386 op amp, which is um, providing the gain of the signal, and that is going to the voltage control pin of a 555 timer that's set to approximately one kilohertz frequency, or, um, yeah, about one kilohertz. Uh, it's an A-stable multivibrator mode, but um, it's modifying the signal by uh, basically frequency modulation uh, using the VCO pin, which is pin five on the 555 timer. That output of which is going through this black wire into the NeoPixel driver. And it seems to be audio responsive fairly well, um, since I have the gain on like the highest making a little buzzing noise. But if I try to make a little noise here, let's try to whistle. It just, um, you know, it's a little microphone, so it doesn't, it's not as sensitive, but I basically have to scream, testing, testing, one, two, three. Seems to work pretty well. It's uh, basically responding in um, the analog way because I'm just basically sending a sound wave to this, um, and that's modulating a carrier wave, which is a one kilohertz signal, and it responds fairly well. So one more whistle test here. Uh, let's try Camp Town Races again. All right. Well, it seems to work. Just has to be, uh, I just have to perfect the signal with, um, with the op amp and everything. Maybe I'll just use a more precise op amp, but fairly sensitive. You know, the LM386 has this gain pin, gain control pin, which is, if I take it off, it's a lot quieter. And you don't get as much amplification of the signal. So it's basically... I have to literally touch this little condenser microphone to make it do anything. So, anyway... Um, it just needs a better amplification, so I got rid of all the gain on this, but the, the gain is usually pretty loud. So anyway, thanks for watching, and I uh, hope you're enjoying the, the progress of this. But um, no coding required for this, no microcontroller. Um, we'll do a how-to video shortly once I play with this a little longer. Thanks. Bye.